In Rogoff v. Siebenmann, high-end art dealers wrangled over a warranty of a painting's provenance. Art dealer Werner Siebenmann had reason to doubt the authenticity of a Francis Bacon self-portrait he was trying to sell. Marlboro Fine Art Gallery in London had pointed out that the painting contained both shiny black paint and pink paint. Bacon was said to use only matte black and never to use pink paint at all. One potential sale had already fallen through when a British art critic warned away the would-be purchaser. Despite these dark clouds, Siebenmann finally sold the painting to David Rogoff for $570,000. The bill of sale stated that Siebenmann had no knowledge of any challenges to the title and authenticity of the painting. Rogoff quickly resold the painting to Aquavela Contemporary Art for $950,000. Aquavela then learned that the painting's authenticity had been challenged. Rogoff had to take the painting back and refund Aquavela's money. Rogoff sued Siebenmann for breach of warranty. The trial court found that Siebenmann had been unsure of the painting's provenance when he sold it to Rogoff and that he knew of a challenge to its authenticity. It granted Rogoff summary judgment. Siebenmann appealed to the Second Circuit. He argued that Rogoff knew about the questions of the painting's authenticity when he bought it, and that he therefore couldn't claim breach of warranty based on the statements in the bill of sale.